Good evening and welcome to another brand new episode of the Poseidon God of Water 20 show. Series 27 still continues with its 18th episode and the show's 963rd overall. That's right. This episode will bring us 37 episodes away from 1,000. Nobody knows it. Well, anyway, let's carry on with it. Simply because that's what we're here to do. So, let's get to it. Everywhere you go, everything you do, just listen. All around, you're surrounded by sound. A do up, a do up, a ding a ding a ding dong. A do up, a do up, a ding a ding a ding dong. We're not gonna go there, cause that test was but a few episodes ago now. Back in episode nine hundred and sixty. That's right. And this is episode... Sorry, did I say episode 960? Yes, I did. This is episode 963. You got it. And now, guys, another thing you got is this animation. This not having any friends thing is getting to be a problem. I feel so down. Four years I've been at the school. Since reception, and I still have no friends. It's wrong. Do thine ears deceive me, or is my little boy having friendship problems? Dad. I'm having trouble fitting in at school, and I'm in year three. I have no friends. Oh no. My poor son. Having the same problem I did when I was a lad of six? This happened to you when you were a boy too? Yes son, it did. September 1995, I was a lonely six year old boy crying outside a classroom door when three children approached me. Those three children were two girls, Sarah and Millie Strabbles. Your mother and aunt as five and nine year olds, and a boy, James Barrett. Your uncle is a seven year old. They sensed how upset I was and took me under their wings and became my friends. My best friends. And since then we've been best friends. 31 years. You're married to mom. Yes I am, and James is married to your aunt. But that's not the point. The point is you won't be friendless for long. Wait and see what happens. 
I hope so, Dad. So, what turns out to be the problem, honeysuckle? Roscoe needs nappies on. That's what. For your information, Lizzie May Stratton. The problem is that your brother still hasn't made any friends at that school. And what he doesn't need is you teasing him. What you just said was very naughty, and will not be tolerated. Apologize to him this instant. But he's acting like a baby. If you don't put a nappy on him, I will. And then I'll give him a dummy. Excuse me, young lady but you do no such thing. You are being very naughty. Again. Get to your room and think about what you've done. Naughty girl. I'll stay. No you won't. You will do as your mother tells you. Go. To. Your. Room. Right now. Right now, my naughty sister is the problem. Lizzie, just get out of my room. Now. You are impossible. I will, once your nappy is on. That's it. If you won't do as you're told, I am changing your nappy, and putting you to bed. You're a very naughty girl. Okay, guys, that was our animation for tonight. That's how naughty Lizzie May Stratton can be for you. It's only episode two of the Stratton family as well. That's right. And now, what do you guys say? Because there's no pile of peat tonight. But what do you say? That we back, 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 this. That's right. No, don't worry, I've not gone crazy. But what I am going to do, guys, is this. Ooh, charming, you might be thinking. Not far from it. Anyway, guys. How about this for a goodbye for this episode? Ah. Yeah. And I'll see you tomorrow. Until then, take care.